Mr. Musselman, oh. what are you doing? You're blocking my son. Oh, sorry, Miss P. I'm just trying out these new solar glasses that I got to experience the coming solar eclipse. Wow, that's great, but what is a solar eclipse? Oh, that's a great question, Miss P. Let's make a model together to find out what a solar eclipse is all about. Sounds great. The word eclipse means to cover or pass over. A solar eclipse happens when the sun appears to be covered or blocked by the moon in our sky. The moon is much, much smaller than the sun, so it has to be lined up just right for that shadow to be cast on our Earth's surface and to create what you and I will experience as a solar eclipse. Because the moon is always moving in a circular pattern or orbit around the Earth, and the Earth is always turning or rotating on its axis, a solar eclipse can only be seen on a single place on Earth for one or two hours at a time. When the moon blocks the sun's light and heat, sudden changes can take place. Temperatures can drop as the sky grows darker. Some animals are tricked into thinking it's nighttime and they begin their evening activities. <laughs> A solar eclipse is an incredible experience for those standing in the right place. And Burlington is one of many communities across America that will be fortunate enough to experience the great American eclipse this April. The Burlington Science Center and Burlington Town Recreation Department are working together to host a special eclipse viewing event on Monday, April 8th, right here at the Senior Center. This will be a special opportunity for our community to come together and enjoy this event with one another. Miss P and I want to make sure everyone can see the partial solar eclipse safely. That's why we'll be offering these solar safe sunglasses during our event. And we'll be encouraging everyone to bring their own solar eclipse pinhole viewer. All you need to make these are some scissors, with a cereal box, a little bit of tin foil, and a pin. What will you experience at this special event? Student and community volunteers will be hosting a variety of science activities, crafts, and investigations. Outside, we will be having an eclipse viewing party, a temperature investigation, sun print paper, UV solar bead bracelets, DIY sundials, a host of live animals. <sniffs> Model a solar eclipse with your very own moon ball. And we are going to have an opportunity to share your homemade eclipse viewers and take a photo for our challenge. Burlington's Great American Eclipse event will take place after school on Monday, April 8th from 2.30 to 4.30 p.m. with the maximum eclipse coverage taking place at 3.30. A parent or guardian is required to attend this event. Registering through Parent Square is appreciated so we know just how many attendees to expect. Reach out to Ms. P or Mr. Musselman through Parent Square if you require accommodations or translation services for this event. Parking will be tight and we'll be watching the eclipse from the field, so bring a good pair of sneakers you don't mind walking in and getting a little muddy. Keep in mind that during Burlington's partial solar eclipse, it will never be safe to look directly at the sun with your eyes alone. The sun's solar radiation is just way too strong and can damage your eyes. Always use a pinhole viewer or certified glasses just like these. We hope to see you there. Hey, 
Where'd everybody go? Nothing left to say, a partial eclipse of the sun. It's coming to Burlington. Burlington.